Nervous patients of Dr. Scott Harrington lined up by the hundreds at this public health clinic Saturday to be tested for hepatitis and the virus that causes AIDS. We got here at 9.30 and we were pretty close to the front and uh, it was that long whenever we went through so it's just grown the whole time. The state dentistry board has filed a 17 count complaint against him after inspectors found problems at his Tulsa area offices including a pressurized cleaner called an autoclave that hadn't been certified as effective in at least six years. Another dentist recommended me to him, say he was best in town at that time. I think people are undoubtedly upset, they're anxious, they're um, upset that this could have happened in their dentist office. The screenings come one day after warnings began going out to approximately 7,000 patients of his who received care during the past six years. Attempts to reach Harrington have been unsuccessful in Oklahoma. Property records show he owns a second home north of Phoenix, but nobody answered there on Saturday. Screenings will resume in Tulsa Monday, and a hearing on whether to revoke his license is set for April 19th. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press.